Yo, what's up guys? Talking Man here. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys a beginner's guide to Dragon Ball Z Adventures Unleashed. But before we get into the video guys, you guys need to see my channel. I want to see more videos like this. You already know. Subscribe. Turn on that bell. If you just want to get that drip, it'll be in the description in the comments below. As well as my Discord. So join the Discord guys. I have posted like... Three videos already, it's so gonna be my fourth one, my last one for today. So it'd be cool. Subscribe. We'll try to get to uh 200 subscribers today. 23,200. We're like 80 away. Come on, we can do it. Alright, guys. But yeah, other than that, see you in the video. Alright, so alright. So when you first spawn in, you customize your character and all that. And once you finish customizing your character, guys, you spawn in here. There's a couple things I wanna like point out in the settings. You might want to take your screen shake off unless you like fighting with screen shake. I mean, it, it kind of gives me a headache, so I <laughs> took it off. And if you want your game to run smooth, fast mode, that's what it does. Look at my graphics. It's kind of choppy because I put fast mode on and I can't take it off, but that's what fast mode does. And then you could turn on or off your toggle experience. So you do your character right there. Clear your inventory if you have like bags and all that. And the power skill too. Always put that one. You don't want to put it under that. You're going to be weak. But yeah. Let me go disable fast mode. Let me be right back. Alright, I'm back, guys. The <laughs> graphics look way better now. So, that's the settings pretty much for you guys. The stats. If you, if you use your abilities, your energy goes up. You keep getting hit, your defense goes up. And then if you punch, that's your strength. And then your moveset storage. You have an option. You can use two abilities at once. So if you uh, you spawn in with the ability, it automatically goes to your moveset storage one. Like for example, you want to get more abilities, right? Talk to Boma, get those arrows. You're able to choose which one you want to put on. It says right here, moveset one or moveset two. If you choose moveset two, you can only put those abilities in number two. So choose wisely, all right? Then you could also get armors too right here. You gotta be a certain level to wear armors, guys. Like for example, you put like a level 80 armor and you're like level one. You cannot wear that. Get to level 80 first. And then you got an item storage right here. I don't know if you can put your bags in here, but y'all let me know if you can't put your bags in here here. But in here. Then you got the shop. You buy stuff with Robux. I, I don't really recommend this. These are easy to get. Yeah, yeah, there's only one spawn. It's this area right here. And now to do quest. So to do your quest, guys. My first one's right here. Quest giver one, and quest giver two is right there. Just follow down the road, and you take you take a turn left right here. It's pretty easy, straightforward. Now to build your mastery, you could either like what is it? Go on your uh, ability, use your attacks, you know, hit stuff. You see it slowly going up. Or you can just hit dummies right here. If you want an AFK gun, just keep punching it. It goes up slowly. Pretty quick, pretty easy. To get money, you know, just keep fighting NPCs. Alright, so there are also legendary abilities in the game. And to do that, there are portals around the map. Like, for example, this one right here. The first one, you gotta be level 100. This is a level 351. And would you look at that, guys? It is. All right, so what's in these rifts are bosses, all right? These boss have a chance to drop legendary abilities. This one right here, you, could, you, you have a chance of getting Goku Black's ability. They're strong, though. I don't recommend going in there. It's going to just level 100. Look at this dude. I can't even attack him. Dude's strong. See how much damage he's doing to me? How much damage did that do to him? Oh, not that bad. But yeah, I recommend having like friends with you or like other people helping you fight because look how much damage they do. Yeah. Good luck if you're fighting this dude on your own. 1% chance I heard from getting a legendary ability from them. Let's get out of here. I can't, like, I, can't, I couldn't even escape. RIP. But yeah, that's pretty much the guide for you right there. Quick beginner's guide. Let me know if it helped, guys. If I'm missing some stuff out, let me know in the comments. Help each other out. But yeah, 
this game's pretty good. I'm having fun playing it. And yeah, hope you guys have a good day. Have fun playing. Game link will be in the description in the comments below. And my Discord. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.